Right, welcome to the webinar. This is Chris Farrell. Okay, let me let me start immediately. This is what we are going to achieve together today. Okay, I'm going to talk you through how to personalize a pre-created sales page for a product. Now, please don't worry already if this sounds slightly complicated. All will be explained in step-by-step -step detail as we progress. Uh, we're also going to personalize a download page for a product, and I'll be explaining in a moment why we need both. And you'll actually be able to grab an actual product as well. All this is for you to sell, and we're going to go through all this in 60 minutes or so. As I've just said, please don't worry at all if, while you're watching this webinar right now, you don't really understand how this works or what to do. Just relax. It's all going to be okay. All I would suggest is if you can be undisturbed for the next 60 minutes or so, and um, I'm sure you are making notes, but it will probably be useful for you to make some notes. Uh, you will be able to access this recording at any time. Okay? All will become clear. I promise you that. Now, why am I doing this webinar? I'll tell you exactly why I'm doing this webinar. This has actually been on my mind for quite a few months. Um, there are loads of great products out there online that you can purchase yourself that are already created for you. What I mean by that is the sales page has already been created, the graphics have already been designed, the product itself has already been made. Therefore, there's a minimal effort from your point of view uh, because everything's pretty much done for you. And this is a great way to start in this business. The problem, however, it sounds too good to be true, doesn't it? The problem with all this is as follows. What happens is, and this happens every single time, you download this really great sounding product, uh, and then you have a folder on your computer that's got lots of various files and maybe some more folders inside it. And honestly, they, they never come with simple instructions, do they? They never come with an easy, understand, easy to understand, here's what to do next instruction manual, if you like. I don't know if this has ever happened to you. Uh, but this happened to me tons when I began. I would uh, when I began online, I would download something, and then once it was on my computer, I was kind of on my own. I didn't really know what to do. And then what happens, of course, is, you, is we all get disillusioned, and then nothing happens. And I struggled big time when I began two years ago. I would download products that look great on the sales page, only to be totally confused as to what to actually do with them when I got them on my computer. Then they kind of they don't care about you, the people that created the product. Then they kind of leave you on the, on your own. Nobody's ever explained exactly what to do with these various files and folders that you download, and it drove me crazy. So I'm going to do this, and there's nothing to sell during this webinar. There's no pitch, there's no product, um, so that's kind of the, the plan, okay? So let me just quickly ask, how are we feeling? Are we feeling okay? Does this, can you relate to this? Has, has this happened to you before? Have you bought something and felt overwhelmed and confused you know that initial enthusiasm of wow this looks great quickly doesn't it disappears into a bit of disappointment thinking well I don't actually know what to do with it um, okay just looking at the replies here thank you guys yeah everyone's saying yes yes definitely we've all felt like this okay wonderful so this is the plan okay I've already bought for you a product that comes with a sales page and it comes with a download page and you can have all this. Um, I paid for it, it's a gift uh, from me to you so you don't need to pay for this at all. Uh, I've already kind of taken care of that part of it. Now just before we actually kind of go into this product, what I thought would be really helpful is if, and this is only going to take two minutes, okay, I just want to quickly explain the, the process of how to sell something online. I'm a huge fan of trying to make sure we actually understand what we're doing before we actually go and do it. And I think the reason that I'm a fan of this is because that's how I have to learn. I can't really do things online, and I couldn't make money online until I actually understood what I was doing. And I know a lot of people kind of have that, that confusion element to their web business. Clearly, that's not a good way to run a business. So there's a great saying, you conquer fear through knowledge. I've said this before. 
we can clear up a lot of this confusion just by spending a few minutes explaining the process. So that's exactly what we're going to be doing. I should just mention as a slight aside, I forgot to mention at the beginning, I've actually got, my, my wife is away at the moment, normally she looks after our four dogs during webinars, but she's away so I've got my four dogs here in the office. So I'm just saying that in case they go crazy at any moment, because sometimes they do. So just wanted to warn you about that. <laughs> right. So let's go through the process of how we actually sell something online, and then we're actually going to get our hands on these files that I've, uh, that I've kind of put together for you. Okay? So here is how to actually sell something online. This is the actual process, and this is what you are going to have um, in 60 minutes from now. It starts with, with a sales page for a product. This is a sales, this is a page that is advertising something to sell, obviously. And creating that sales page alone can take months, but as I say, I've got a sales page for you that you can get your hands on. Now, the very first thing we have to do is we have to configure the buy now button or the payment button or the click here to purchase button on that sales page. So if anybody does purchase, the money, of course, goes to you. So we're going to do that in a second. There is a buy now button on the sales page that we need to do a little few things to. And we're going to go through this in today's webinar. So if somebody does purchase, then the money goes to you. That kind of makes sense, doesn't it? So we'll do that in a few moments' time. Now, the process is as follows. Once we have a sales page advertising a product to sell and somebody likes it and they click on the buy now button, as soon as they click on the buy now button, they get taken to somewhere where they can give their payments. Now, for the sake of this webinar, uh, we're going to use PayPal. There are many different ways of allowing you to receive money. PayPal is the easiest, and that's what we're going to use today. So we then need to do a few things at PayPal, and I'm going to go through all this as well. Once we've configured a few little things at PayPal, uh, we then tell PayPal after somebody has successfully paid for your product to send this customer of yours to the download page where your customer can actually access the product that they have purchased just a few moments earlier. So that's very simply the process, and I say it very simply, again, when I began, this took me about four months to understand. Nobody explained it as simply as this. We have a sales page. We need to configure the payment button, the buy now button on that sales page to allow us to take the money. And then, once we take the money, we then need to tell our customer, here's your product. So that's kind of what we're going to be going through over the next 20 minutes or so. Let me just quickly check in with you, because I'm always aware of energy, and um, I want to to try and keep you as focused as possible on this. Does that make sense so far, the process? Sales page, we have a buy now button that goes to a payment processor, in this example, PayPal, and we then tell PayPal, hey, after somebody buys, send them here to get the product. Okay, everyone's saying yes. Again, I know for some, this, this is, I might be over-egging the pudding, but I am aware there's an awful lot of people on this webinar that, that do not understand this, so I always like to make sure we're all on the same page before we continue. Great. Okay, so let's continue. So that's how to actually sell something online. So what I've done, as I've just mentioned a few moments ago, is I've bought the rights to a really great product uh, that comes with a sales page. It comes with a download page. So these are already created for you. All we need to do is configure them and add a few little details to make it personal to you. So we're going to personalize your sales page and your download page. So that's exactly what we're going to do. Today, we're going to personalize a pre-created sales page that I've got for you and personalize a pre-created download page. So there's two pages we need to personalize. On the right of your screen here, you can see um, this is the sales page, actually. And it looks just really professional, doesn't it? I've just seen somebody type in the question window saying, I thought you weren't selling anything. I'm not selling anything. There's nothing to sell in this webinar. And what I'm saying here is I'm giving this to you. I'm giving you these files. There's absolutely nothing to sell. Um, so, yes, please don't worry. There's no sales pitch at all. On the right-hand side of your computer screen here is the sales page that you will have in a few moments' time that you can then use to sell this product and, of course, keep 100% of the money that 
that you generate. Okay? Right. Over the next 60 minutes then, now we kind of understand the process of how to make money online. Excuse me. Over the next 60 minutes, this is what we're going to do. And we will take a break in about 60 minutes time as well, if you are clock watching or watching the Spain game. Uh, we're going to download the files that we need. Uh, we're then going to look at these various files so you understand exactly what it is we have downloaded. Uh, this is where, and I include myself in this when I began, an awful lot of information overload starts because we have all these files and various different named folders and nobody explains what they are. And it can be confusing, can't it? It can be overwhelming. So I want to just go through when we download these files what we've actually got. Because once you understand this, you can use this for every single product that you download because they're all similar. They might look a little bit different, but they're all basically structured in the same manner as you're about to see. Uh, we're then going to configure our sales page. Remember me telling you there are two pages. There's the sales page and the download page. So we're going to configure the sales page to add your details. And we're then going to configure the download page to add your details. You'll be quite amazed as well, A, how easy this is, and B, how there isn't really that much to do. There's only about two or three things we need to do on each, and that's it. We're then going to create a payment link using PayPal. So we need something to allow us to actually receive the money, of course. So I'll be going through that. Uh, we will then upload everything. That means we'll get it online. So it all works. And then I'll actually go online live and we will test it all and we'll make a purchase as well. So that's kind of the plan. Um, I'd just like to quickly add what I am not going to be going through today. Um, a couple of things I'm not going to be going through. I am not going to spend ages explaining Composer. To make these changes to the sales page and the download page, we have to use an HTML editor. Now, I'm sure most of you know this, but I teach to use Composer, which is free. My ebook, Create Your First Website by 3.45 this afternoon, my video course, all is based around Composer. This webinar, though, is not about Composer, because I could spend a few hours going through that, as I do in my ebook and my, my video course. So I'm not going to go through Composer in, in, in a lot of detail. I'll be using Composer, but I'll go through it quite quickly. I'm also not going to spend ages explaining how to upload. Again, I've got tons of other videos explaining how to upload. And if, you, if you're a complete newcomer and you've never uploaded something before, that's fine. But I will be going through the actual upload process relatively quickly because, again, I could spend half an hour explaining that. And I do. And I have tons of videos um, explaining that if you are unfamiliar with that. If you don't have a web page yet, that's absolutely fine. We, we want to go through the, the process today of how to sell something online. 